okay students uh, in the last uh, two videos we uh, wrote programs for finding out uh, the minimum and maximum values of integer and character data type let's try to uh, find out the minimum and maximum ranges of uh, or the minimum and maximum value that can be stored in float double and long double data type so for this you have to include header files hash include io stream and io stream and then using namespace std standard namespace and after this you have to use uh, another or you have to include another header file and that is uh, float um, that is I think um, float.h so float.h is included here and from here onwards you have to write the main function okay again you have to uh, write this statement see out the smallest value value that can be stored in uh, in float so let's try to use this float flt underscore m i n and then in line and let's try to use another c out statement c out for the for largest value largest value that can be stored in float so flt underscore max and in line similarly for the double what you have to do you have to write the same statement smallest value that can be stored in double so what you can do is dpl double underscore min and end line and you have to write the uh, statement again for finding the largest value that can be stored in double so dpl underscore max end line and again you have to write another statement the smallest value that can be stored in long double so l d b l underscore m i n any minimum and load the largest value that can be stored in long double ldpl long double underscore max so this is basically um, the ranges for the different uh, real type values now float uh, minimum float maximum will show us the minimum and maximum value that can be stored in float uh, data type similarly dpl minimum any double minimum that uh, the minimum value that can be stored in double and the maximum value that can be stored in double will be printed in this uh, line and then ldpl long uh, double minimum and this is basically the long double maximum so this will print us the minimum this will print us the minimum and this will print us the maximum long double uh, value so now let's try to save this program by ld or by float fl okay now let's try to compile and run this code and see that 
Now you can see here these are basically the value that can be stored in uh, that can be stored in the float similarly this is the minimum value this is the maximum value that can be stored in uh, uh, float and this is the double that can be stored in the minimum double this is the maximum double and this is the minimum long double and this is the maximum long double so thank you very much for watching this video i hope you like this